Welcome back. And in our top business story, Dubai Properties Group of Dubai Holding has established Dubai Properties as its dedicated development company in order to leverage the real estate market. According to news agency WAM, Dubai Properties will focus on delivering an integrated end-to-end -end project development solution for the group. For all new and existing built-to-sell projects, Dubai Properties will manage the entire spectrum, from project building and sales to handover services upon completion. The company will include structural, engineering and business development departments, as well as dedicated sales, marketing and customer service. A brand refresh will also be revealed through a marketing campaign due to be rolled out in the coming months. Dubai Properties will now be commercially and operationally responsible for developing projects including Dubai Land's Mudon Business Bay Towers and Maria Residences in Business Bay, in addition to the city's first creekside destination, Culture Village. Nikhil has signed a management agreement with Accor for its 250-room Dragon Mart Hotel. According to a statement, construction on the project is now substantially complete and will be managed by Accor under the Ibis Styles brand. The hotel is a part of Nikhil's 1 billion dirham, 177,000 square meter Dragon Mart expansion project, which also includes a second mall and a multi-story car park. And phase two will bring the total size of the Dragon Mart complex to 335,000 square meters. The hotel is one of nine planned by Nikhil over the next five years, which will be located on the Palm Jumeirah, Dera Islands, even Batuta Mall and International City. US company Six Flags Entertainment Corporation and Dubai's Miras Leisure and Entertainment have announced plans to bring a theme park to Dubai. According to a company statement, the Six Flags branded theme park project is set to open in 2017 in Jebel Ali. Raid Al Nuaymi, the chief leisure and entertainment officer for Miras LE, was quoted as saying that a part of their commitment towards creating one-of-a-kind experiences and contributing towards the Dubai Tourism Vision 2020, their association with Six Flags will help them develop a world-class destination that redefines the industry and positively impacts the regional tourism sector. Gulf banks outperformed their global rivals in 2013, according to the latest survey, recording double-digit revenues. The report by the Boston Consulting Group shows that revenues of banks in Qatar grew by 20%, while banks here in the UAE returned to double-digit growth of 19%. Banks in Bahrain enjoyed a 30% profit increase. It added that the UAE and Saudi Arabian banks repeated provision levels of 2012 of 3.3 billion US dollars and 1.7 billion respectively. It also revealed that in 2013, retail banking revenues in the GCC experienced a further upswing of 7.2%, largely due to an increase in the UAE. The report added that overall growth of revenues was largely due to several significant acquisitions of foreign banks.